How do you launch your brand towards infinite growth? My name is Michael Silverstein. I'm the principal author of a new book. The book is called Rocket, and it's the story of 16 entrepreneurs and the creation of their brands. It has a number of lessons that I hope will grab you. Chapter two is about wooing your biggest fans. Fanatical fans create the bedrock for successful brands. In the book Rocket, we tell the story of the container store and how they get this lesson right. This is the story that says, let me engage a small number of consumers. Let me own them emotionally. And it says contain yourself, the container store. It comes out of economics. It's the rule of 2, 20, 80, 150. 2% of your customers directly generate 20% of your sales. They indirectly advocate your brand to as much as 80% of your volume. That 80% of your volume generates 150% of your profitability. It's the fanatic fan that turns to their friend and says, you should try this. You should come here. Let's go shopping together. But how did the Container Store create a loyal fan base? Kip Tyndall, the founder of the Container Store, and John McKay, the founder of Whole Foods, were housemates at the University of Texas. Neither one of them finished college. Kip loved to tinker and was working in a hardware store when he asked himself, what's the biggest problem that women have at home? Not their husbands, it's not their children, it's organizing their lives, and it's being able to find things. But this was not Kip's only great idea. He realized that to capture the hearts and minds of loyal customers, he needed a great sales force on the selling floor. This particular charging station comes in five colors. One great employee is equal to the productivity or the value of three good employees. We actually put the employee first, and if you really and truly, I mean really and truly take better care of the employee than anybody else, uh, they really will take better care of the customer than anybody else. Container store associates are treated with respect, given hundreds of hours of training, pay twice the wage of competitors, and turn over at a fraction of the average rate. They are a perpetual favorite company to work for. Kip Tyndall lays out his principles for success. Kip's book is called Uncontainable, and I think what's really wonderful about it is he tells the story of man in the desert selling. And every employee can tell the story. A man in the desert walks into an oasis saying, I need water, I need water. But he needs so much more than water. He needs some medical attention, he needs food. So getting him that drink of water wouldn't be getting him everything he needs. It's every part and piece, every single thing that's gonna create a complete solution to make, um, to really enhance our customers' lives. So you really understand them. Yeah, absolutely. It's a store that allows you to find something at every moment that you're shopping. Make your dreams for your brand come true. Read Rocket, eight lessons to secure infinite growth. Curtis, thank you. It's my Fantastic. pleasure. Remember, woo your biggest fans. Next, lesson number three.